I see a variety of children in my clinic. The conditions are also a diversity of diseases, so ranging from constipation to reflux to liver disease, inflammatory bowel disease, and celiac disease. I am really excited about the GI program here at Cahovnanian Children's Hospital. We have now six gastroenterologists, all with really unique skill sets and talents. Most recently, we just added a gastroenterologist who has an expertise in motility disorders. And with this type of uh, skill set, we can now understand how the intestine is functioning. And it's really helpful in kids who have constipation or swallowing difficulties. Our GI doctors provide very uh, personalized support to uh, children and their families. So I'm incredibly proud of the work that they do. Here with the types of diseases that we see, we can really change a child's life. We have treatments now that have actually cured certain types of diseases. And with our uh, diagnostic techniques, we can really diagnose things that we weren't able to before. So I believe that in the field of pediatric gastroenterology, we are really uh, transformative and we've made some unique contributions over the last few decades. My areas of interest and focus are in procedures and also in liver disease. I've been uh, working in different committees and groups to really set the national uh, guidelines for pediatric endoscopy procedures in children. I uh, perform the uh, variety of GI procedures, including endoscopic uh, assessments uh, and uh, pH and impedance uh, probes. Most of the procedures that we do are both diagnostic and therapeutic. So we can, uh, for example, both diagnose a child who might have polyps and also therapeutically remove them at the same time uh, during the same procedure. My research focus has been in advancing health equity in pediatric gastroenterology. My goal is to be sure that every child in New Jersey has the same access and opportunity to health care. The work that I've been doing has looked at pediatric endoscopy procedures and try to understand how we can better uh, design our care delivery system to be sure that kids have the same access to endoscopy and that they don't need to come to an emergency room for emergency procedures they can get these procedures on an elective basis before things become a crisis.